Hi Healthcare Professional. This short video is for you to learn about adverse event reporting. You play an important role when prescribing medicines to your patients and having overall responsibility for the safety of your patients. Adverse events are any untoward medical occurrences in a patient or a clinical investigation subject administered a pharmaceutical product. Adverse events do not necessarily have a causal relationship with the treatment. Pharmaceutical companies, as medicine marketing authorization holders, need to follow the adverse event reporting requirements according to EU and local regulations. In Finland, this is the Medicines Act and female regulations. Pharmaceutical companies need to continuously monitor the safety of their medicines during their whole life cycle. Patients and customers can report adverse events. Among healthcare providers, adverse event reporting is encouraged. However, within pharmaceutical companies, adverse event reporting is mandated to all employees and vendors providing services to the company. Marketing authorization holders and health authorities are interested in adverse events, but also other reportable information, such as medicine use during pregnancy and breastfeeding, lack of medicinal effect, medicine misuse, medication errors, and so forth. This information can occur either in connection with adverse events or not. By collecting adverse events, we learn more about the safety of medicines and we can provide up-to-date safety information to healthcare professionals and patients, not only in Finland, but also globally. For example, we can learn that medicine doses can be decreased for older patients while still providing the same effect but avoiding unfortunate adverse events. Another example could be learning about medicine safety during breastfeeding without harming the child. We can also put specific controls in place to avoid adverse events occurring if we understand the high risk related to specific medicines. Those controls are called additional risk minimization measures. Up-to-date product information can be found from package information leaflets, summaries of product characteristics, risk minimization related materials and activities. These documents are updated when new relevant information has been received and when needed. You can find the materials through FEMA, the European Medicines Agency and from the marketing authorization holder websites. Please report all adverse events and experiences you become aware of to FEMA or to the product marketing authorization holder. The company might turn to you for additional information afterwards, since by collecting all available information, the company can make an assessment of the possible causality between the medicine and the adverse event. By learning more about the safety of the medicines, we increase patient safety. The safe use of well-known medicines improves health and is also cost-effective. At the time a medicine gets its approval, it has been tested with a limited group of patients that don't necessarily represent the real-world patient population. By reporting adverse events, you add to the pool of collected data which can be used for the benefit of real-world patients. We all want to work to improve lives and for the best of the patients. We want to ensure that medicines are as safe and as efficient as possible for the patients. In order to report adverse events, or if you have any questions about the process, go to www.femea.fi or contact the marketing authorization holder of the medicine in question. Remember that adverse event reporting matters, and by reporting, you play an important role in the safety of the patients. It's a small time investment for big benefits. Thank you for watching.